Hi friends, I'm Yamini and I welcome you back to my astrology channel, The Saffron Box. And today continuing with the series of Ketu in Signs, I'm going to be talking about uh, the placement of Ketu in the sign of Taurus. What happens if you have this placement in your natal chart? Right, so I'm talking about natal chart, your birth horoscope. I'm not referring to transits. Transits happen every year and natal chart is something which you're born with. You know, that is what the universe has given you at the time of your birth. Right, so uh, if we understand this placement of uh, Ketu in the sign of Taurus, uh, we need to understand uh, Taurus a bit. Now, Taurus, if you see, is a sign owned by Venus. And this is a sign which uh, talks about uh, accumulation. In the Kal Purush Kundli also, in the Kal Purush or the National Horoscope, it is the second house. So it talks about accumulation, it talks about wealth, it talks about your material possessions. It's a fixed and earthy sign and a very, very stable sign. Right, so it talks about all the things which you like to possess. And what do we like to possess materially? We like to possess cash. Uh, bonds, uh, jewelry, money, you know, family money, accumulation, valuable things. Since uh, Taurus is also, you know, it, it talks about beauty and refinement. So such people like to collect beautiful things. You know, they have a sense of, uh, they have a very good sense of art, keen eye towards art, good sense of aesthetics. And uh, they, they have this innate quality of appreciating beautiful things because that is something with Ketu being there in the sign of Taurus, that is something which they have already mastered in their past lives. So uh, they are able to you know, appreciate all this, they are able to manage all this, they have this innate ability, you know, they, they know how to manage money, they know how to uh, you know, acquire beautiful things, keep beautiful things. Uh, pick out something valuable and uh, appreciate it, uh, have a good sense of taste, have a good sense of uh, picking up luxurious and rare, precious uh, items as such. So I'm talking about all the material things over here. But Ketu uh, being here in this sign, Ketu is a dry planet first of all and secondly, Ketu is the planet of renunciation. Ketu is a planet of detachment. So whichever sign it is in, it tries to create a sense of detachment from that, from those qualities, or uh, you know, from the uh, from the significations of that sign or from that house as well. So uh, such an individual, though he or she has a keen eye of uh, you know keen eye for beautiful things is able to manage everything materially but the lesson is to basically move out and not get too attached towards material things look out towards the other realm of rahu in scorpio because when you have ketu in taurus right 180 degrees opposite ketu you'll find rahu in the sign of scorpio and scorpio is a sign of transformation scorpio is a sign of renewal of unexplored territories so uh, this placement tells the individual to uh, satisfy their needs, yes, whatever the need comes to them, but not get uh, too overly attached to material things, not get overly attached with money matters. And slowly, gradually, the individual actually, by the time he or she matures, uh, crosses 35, 40, the, uh, this sense of uh, exploring the other energies moving towards renewal, transformation, exploring spirituality deep within, all these qualities get enhanced. So what happens? The second half of the life is more satisfying because in the first half, there's struggle. The first half tells you that Ketu is trying to, you know, cut the cord of with uh, Taurus over there. Ketu is trying to pose some challenges over there with uh, Taurus matters as such. Right, so the idea is to uh, maintain your needs, to look after your needs, but look towards renewal, look towards transformation. Right, so that is an effective way of handling this energy of Ketu in the sign of Taurus. I'll uh, come back soon with uh, Ketu in the sign of Gemini. Till then, keep watching and do not forget to give me a like, give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Thank you so much.